The University of Virginia had a 230,000 square foot four-story chemistry building that was built in 1963 and they wanted to totally renovate the MEP systems while cutting energy use by half. But the challenge is the first two floors had to be continuously occupied during the renovation. The original system was a constant air volume dual duct system distributed through a central spine. Here we're following the vertical distribution from one air handler that supplies air to the laboratories on levels 4, 3, 2, and 1. Every exhaust valve was ducted up to exhaust headers on the roof. For phase one of the renovation, we reuse the existing exhaust fans, fit them with variable frequency drives, add another fan for redundancy, and then add heat recovery coils. We then add two new air handling units at the old cooling tower wells, and created four new vertical shafts at the end of the central utility spine. From these vertical shafts, we supply horizontal mains that will serve each floor. For phase one, only the horizontal mains for the first two levels is installed. Then, one lab at a time, we disconnect each space from the existing air handling unit and patch into the horizontal main served by the new air handlers. We go through levels one and two like this until both floors are switched over to the two new air handlers. With levels one and two switched over to the new infrastructure without disruption, we can go through and swap out the remaining air handling units and supply levels three and four. Finally, we can outfit each lab with a modern chilled beam system.